What's up everybody, it's Nick. Do you want to make money being an amazing interior detailer? Do you just want to get any stain out of any carpet in general? Well, I'm an auto detailer, but I'm here to tell you about what I'm learning from the professional carpet cleaning world. I've got amazing toys like the Brush Pro. Did a video about that one. The Pro Team Vacuum. It's pretty cool. A nice extractor. But today I want to tell you about the Bridgepoint Professional Spotting Kit. There are all kinds of toys and tools in here that will help you get almost any stain out of carpets. Take a look. I just go back and forth. So again, this is the uh, Bridgepoint Professional Spotting Kit. It, it's made an appearance in a video or two. Um, it's got a series of chemicals in here, but you're not on your own. What's amazing about this is it comes with a stain removal guide. It gives you a sense of, okay, you ever seen Kool-Aid, children's red medicine, fruit punch, decaffeinated coffee? Well, it tells you exactly what to do. You may not even have any idea how to get red stains out. Maybe you're like, hey, red stains, those are impossible. I'll never get those out. Well, how about Red Zone Ready? And how about a list of exactly what to do? Um, usually what you wanna do is apply um, enough to thoroughly wet the stained area, but not enough to soak in the backing. Then you can uh, put a wet cotton towel over stain, and you can use a uh, heated iron, um, and then check every 20 to 30 seconds. I'm told a steamer works as well, so your triangle attachment on your steamer uh, works great. So there you go. You ever wanted to know how to get rid of red stains? Boom, there it is. What about organic stains and natural dyes? Urine, coffee, mold. Well, it tells you to apply stain zone to the contaminated area, and then it gives you detailed instructions. Stain zone's right here, boom. Oxidizing stain remover, works like magic. Okay, let's see what else there is. How about oil resin pigmented base? Let's say like uh, ink, right? Or uh, cosmetics, some lipstick, you know, whatever uh, ends up on the carpeting. Well, I don't know, what do I do? You can use Avenge Pro, uh, dry extract with your vacuum tool, and then apply All Solve uh, Extreme. Well, where's my Avenge Pro in here? That's for rust, that's All Solve Extreme right there. And there's my Avenge Pro, so Avenge Pro, all solve extreme and then it wants you to mist with a product called spot stop and it's a little dirty because i've been using this recently on cloth seats um as as i'm ending my detail i'll just lightly mist this onto uh, upholstery or carpets where i don't want any wicking and it works amazing so wicking is a, is a really tough problem for auto detailers um, i've been in here a couple of times already so i haven't really used these towels but i'm sure they were like neatly folded up when i got them what other toys and tricks are in here? Facilitated spot and stain training video. Oh my gosh, that's cool. I haven't even watched that. That'll be fun to watch. They have actual like um, spotting courses, by the way, to the professional carpet cleaning world. Some nice nitrile gloves there. Okay, these look like they're probably terry cloths. Um, what else comes in this handy kit? Oh, I think I see some toys down there. What do we found? Okay, this is the top of the uh, spot stop, and then this is the um, the gum getter. What was really fun the other day, I did a video about using gel break and uh, how to really safely remove gum from carpets. And actually, there's detailed instructions there. Poke holes in gum with gum getter. Apply gel break to surface of gum and let dwell for five to 10 minutes. Agitate and remove gum with the gum getter and then you can apply some more gel break. So I've got that video uh, and I can post a link to that. How about blood, chocolate sauce, eggs, protein, right? Well, you would wanna remove as much as you could, apply some Avenge Pro, let it dwell. You'd rinse it possibly, when they say rinse, that means extract. This is my extractor here, um, but I've got a video on extractors too. I like the Mighty Light for cars and that's down in the garage. Um, you can rinse and repeat. So you've got this really professional looking kit. Uh, it almost seems like an insulated lunchbox. 
Again, I've got a couple of you know tools in here that I can put in the zippered area. Um, I've got this, which is my handy brush. You can, which is nice on like regular carpet because you can kind of get the pile standing straight up, which helps it dry faster. And then you know some of these things like here, you could pick at gum. So I may just put that back into there. Um, but you've got Avenge Pro, uh, Gel Break, All Solve Extreme. Uh, T rust, you know, I, I know we see rust in, in cars, especially a, a work truck stain zone. And you might be wondering, well, how the hell do I use all this stuff? Well, it comes with this amazing guide. I want to tell you one more trick because I went to a two day carpet class uh, and I'll put a link to that video above. I went to carpet college, learned a bunch of great stuff. If you're interested in this stuff, I encourage you to delve into that. But Bridgepoint Systems has a spot and stain guide. Um, what I've done is I've just looked up Interlink, and when I look up Interlink Supply, I believe, uh, the app shows up in my uh, particular, uh, you know, Apple store or whatever, and then I can uh, basically uh, look up any particular stain, and it gives me exact instructions using all these chemicals. But I went to this two-day class, and this is going to tell you about natural fibers like wool. It's very sensitive, for instance, to uh, alkalinity. Are you going to see wool in car carpets? Probably not, outside of like a Bentley, maybe. Uh, if at all. Uh, upholstery though, and that's what we're talking about with car seats or maybe, you know, uh, Sally customer asks you if you can get a stain out of her couch. Upholstery is a different ball game altogether. And so here's going to teach you a little bit about upholstery. Um, you can train, you can practice, t gives you tips about testing. But I'm telling you guys, there's so many resources. Check out this app. I haven't looked at bridgepoint.com. Uh, Bridgepoint and Interlink or Ramsco seem to be affiliated. They may be the same company. I'm not quite sure. Uh, but I've gone to my local supplier, the Interlink or Ramsco store, uh, and that's where I've gotten all these Bridgepoint systems. But yeah, it tells you there are five primary categories of stains. It gives you all the chemicals you could ever need. It gives you this handy laminated guide that you can carry with you at all times. And I'm telling you guys, even just using Spot Stop to prevent wicking, it has polymers in it. It's going to prevent things from wicking back on you. Uh, gel break is great for gum. And I haven't even used a lot of these. I'm really excited uh, to have these into my arsenal. And then at one point, you know, I want to be like an expert interior detailer, um, being able to see a situation and be able to charge more if there's a red stain and ask the customer, hey, if I can get this out, you know, it's going to be an involved process. Are you willing, you know, do you want me to go after this or just try you know, my pre-spray, blah, blah, blah. Uh, still working on that sort of conversation. But ideally, right, we get good enough that we can charge what we think we're worth. And uh, the more education you have and the more you can sell that, I think the better. So I am loving this uh, Bridgepoint Professional Spotting Kit. I'm looking forward to uh, watching um, this video. I know they have like a one or two day training class uh, just for spotting. So that's a certain, it's an art in itself. So I know we're used to just putting heavy amounts of degreaser, maybe steaming and extracting and hoping for the best. And when we get lucky, we think we're, you know, uh, you know, a gift from God. But, but this is actually a systematic approach to all different kinds of stains from rust to uh, ink, paint, nail polish, and more to egg or ink, lipstick or blood. I mean, look at the technology that we can tap into as auto detailers. Let's elevate the industry. Let's improve our craft. I know that ceramic coatings and buffing and polishing uh, Lamborghinis are sexy, but this is where the need is and will be no matter what happens to the economy. Interior detailing will always be a thing. I encourage you to improve your education. Let's have a conversation. I'm going to put a link to this uh, Bridgepoint spotting kit in the, uh, in, the, in the description below. And if you want to like help my channel a little bit, I mean, I'm just making these videos out of passion. So if you, uh, you want to buy this, Go for it, you know. Uh, if you just want to buy these individual products, go for that. Whatever you want to do, but I think I get a small percentage if you guys uh, uh, buy this particular kit off of Amazon. I'm just starting to learn about affiliate links, right? I'm just trying to survive, and I love making these videos, and uh, I love the conversation. So, uh, not getting rich over here, just trying to tell you about some of the toys that I've bought, and uh, if they can help you, that would be amazing. This Brush Pro is pretty darn cool. These are the renovator trays. Um, whatever. I did a video about that. Like I said, I'm rambling now, but tell me what you think about this professional spotting kit. I love how if I were to do professional carpets, like in people's homes, that just looks so professional and, uh, I could sort of whip it out and have all these fancy chemicals and, and, uh, and, and do a great job. And then, 
Uh, this is a pretty cool vacuum as well, but of course that has nothing to do with auto detailing. So uh, have a great day, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and let me know what you think in the comments below. Have a great one. Bye-bye.